Greetings, everybody, and welcome to Sins of a Solar Empire. Doing a playthrough here, and I've got my buddy Sparky with me, and we are going to play in alliance against some um, probably hard opponents. So we're probably going to get rolled pretty quickly here. And actually, one thing, keep toning the music down, it always seems too loud. So there we go. Alrighty, so let's get this thing started. I will be playing as the TEC, and Sparky, what are you going to be playing as? I'm not too sure yet. <clears throat> I know you're a fan of the Advent, so I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, I'll probably just play as them. Okay, let's see here. What do we want to do real quick? I didn't even think this through. We need a mission here. We'll do a medium map. Just random medium? Yeah, we'll do random. Random, small, competitive. There's a lot of randoms. I don't see... How many max player stars, one, planets, 22? Okay, we're back, and I kind of just kicked Sparky. Whoops, my bad. But anyways, here we go. Victory conditions and game options. We've had a couple of snafus already, but I think we're beyond that now. So let's do this. Okay. All right. So we're going to start these guys out. We're going to have an aggressor and a fortifier. The fortifier will be TEC loyalists. What did I do? Oh, wrong one. And we'll have Vasari loyalists. And let's do this. And let's do... Make sure they're on the same team. Yeah, I'll do that. Good idea. I'll make them purple. Meh. Alright, we're gonna be... No, we're gonna be red and... Yeah, that's good. So, there we go. Alright, and I think we're set. Oops, these are supposed to be hard. And, yeah, that looks good. Here we go. All right. Yay! Hopefully we did this right this time. All right, I like being red for some reason. I kind of have this red kick, if you saw my Hawking video. So, anyway, um, I'm not going to explain the game too much, because it's kind of involved, but it is a 4X strategy game, and it's really big, as you can see. You can zoom very far out, and sometimes there's multiple star systems as well. But one of the first things that's kind of cool about this game is you can actually get your first capital ship for free. So I'm going to build a coal battleship because coal battleships are awesome. And we'll be using him to start expanding our empire ever so slowly. Ooh, looks like we got some fun stuff. What are you? Take mine. Star has not been explored. So it's just showing up. That worries me. I don't remember those spinning like that before. Hey, Sparky, is the star spinning on your screen? No. Uh, if you click on it. Oh, it spins. Oh, that's cool. Okay, back to the game. So we're going to have ourselves a battle cruiser pretty quickly. All right. A so titan factory is required. Yeah, I didn't mean to click on that. We're not dealing with titans right now. All right, we're going to set up some stuff. I'm going to basically split initially between both uh, military and civil research. That'll be something we want to deal with. But at the moment, I would like to get a small fleet together. Do six of those. Oh, my Arcovas. These are your I little scouts. Let them do something useful. Yes. Yes. And now the scouts of war are upon the us. The scouts for habitable right. planets to expand my empire. Okay. Reporting for duty. Yeah, we got Sean in the background here too, and Sean at some point will likely end up getting his own capital ship because, well, just because. Alrighty. Bye. <laughs> no, don't so, give it to him. The first ship, though, is going to be Zar Hootie. And it will be the planet. Kia for many reasons. One finished. particularly, because that's what I had for dinner. Reporting for duty. And this is the Gauze Railgun. From here on out, you will hear me referring to it as the Potato Cannon. That's what I call it. And we will be focusing a lot on the Potato Cannon because it's great. Cool. The Potato Cannon. That's awesome. Right. Yes. Yes, Commander. All right, we got ourselves a small fleet. I'm gonna wait for the two, at least two more Reporting of these guys to build up. There's one of them. Which means the other one should be right by it. I didn't build. I did this right, right? One, two, three. Oh, oh I built two at the Good same time. Good day, Commander. Weirdness. All right, what do we got? Ooh, Gromov. Gromov is an ice planet. What's our capital, by the way? We are. 
Ideos, something like that. I might just call it Idaho, it's so close. Okay, fleet's under attack. Oh, okay, that's why. Can you guys discover that? This is a dwarf planet, which I believe is new. They're kind of useful. Complete. So we're going to go with that. And I guess the first thing we'll do is done. take this down. Oceanic planet? I think that's new, dude. Oh, that is new. You found an oceanic? I've never seen one before. Oh, Scouts sweet. Found a Intense gravity planet. field. They that's are cool. supposed to allow you to have a greater population. Hmm. It's like I think at first it's like a low population, but then you can research underwater civilizations and you get like massive population. So that's gonna be cool. That's, that's Sparky over there. That's useful. Yes, indeed. Phase jump complete. All right. No, another cool thing about this game is you're probably gonna be seeing me playing a lot from this perspective. And the reason why is because just about anything you could ever Good want day, to do in this Commander. game regarding your civilization can be done from here, and that's awesome. All right, looks like there's absolutely nothing to care about here. Oh, one of the things we need to build is... What was that? What? Air gunfire. Oh, hey, there's something to kill, guys. Let's, uh, let's deal with that. I don't even pay attention. I'll make short work out of them. Um... Okay. All right, well, we're watching that. I am going to get set up. Colonizer. There we go. Good day, Commander. Explode. Yeah. This shall be our finest hour. How are we doing over here? Looks like we're going okay. We have one cobalt right me. here whose shields are down. But I think he'll be fine. <coughs> We're gonna have to tone Sparky's uh, microphone down just a tad. He's coming out a little loud. That's good. Loud. Next video. New really? Can you adjust that, like, actually on there? Or? Ready for battle. I don't know. That's kind of weird. No. Yeah, well, we'll worry with it next video. Get a little tab and adjust it there. Right, yes, Commander. See. Oh, that's right. You At can once. alt tab. I can't. Ready for yeah, cool. orders. Can you hear me? Transmission good received. <laughs> How's that? I can still hear you pretty well. You said it a little bit Oh, that's the volume. Oh, that's the... Oh, you have to Good. switch it. Hold on. Let me get to my fleet so Good day, people have something Commander. they can watch. You guys are loving this, aren't you? Oh, these technical difficulties. Here, let's see real quick. Let's die. Okay, say, whoops, say something now. Hey. Scouts have found Hello. a colonizable planet. Louder. Hello. Let's see. Okay, cool. Try to talk about that volume. I think we're okay now. Are we getting some feedback hiss? That sounds kind of weird. I think it's still there, but it's a lot less than it was. So. We'll roll with that. In the meantime, we're going to blow this up. Yeah, I'm like the world's worst YouTuber. I know it. All that stuff should have been figured out earlier. But you know what? I'm natural. And we're winning. Dude, I'm just amazing. Scouts have found a colonized planet. We found more colonizable planets, so that's a plus. Alright, we're gonna torque this. I'll make sure to work out it. This Ross! Awesome! We just took a planet. Scouts have found a colonized Actually, since I got Sparky lower, I'm going to have to make my sound effects a little lower. Sorry, guys. I know it's pretty awesome. Also, try to keep in close so you'll hear stuff. What's up? Uh, bad. Computer? I don't see them. At all. I mean, oh, they're around. I know they're around. It's one star system, right? Yep, one star system. Good day, Commander. You'll find them. I don't know what they're up to, but, uh... 
Oh, I did just notice we've got two wormholes. They probably link. But if they don't, they could be on the other side of that. That would be interesting. Okay. Oh, no, we're losing a uh, cobalt, so I'm going to try to send him back, but I think he's done. Yeah. Ah, oh, it's good on you, buddy. Everybody loves you, but you died. Sorry. It's okay. As long as the battle cruiser's intact, we're good. Uh, I've never figured out in this game if you should really be targeting the Gardas first, because if you look at their statistics... Uh, I'm not seeing it on here, but I think it shows it for my stuff. But anyways, it, um, it seems like the Gardas actually do more damage than the Cobalts do. Yeah, I Cobalt, aren't the Cobalts planet killers? No. No, the Cobalts are like the stock frigate. Good day, Commander. Oh my gosh, they're actually tearing us apart. But you know what? It'll be worth it in the end. Scouts have found a colonizing planet. Alright, let's take this out. It's, it's sad. Oh, I didn't even notice that. They have a javelin. Err. Pay more attention. All right, we're gonna kill this Garda, and then we're gonna focus the javelin. Whoa, your cell phone. Yes, Commander. <laughs> At once. Ready for battle. Moo har har. Oh, hello. Yeah, they're here. Find them. Yeah, I found purple. Planet development finished. The Vanitas faction. They're not even a federation. They're just a faction. Sucks to be that. The others, yeah. Why is this so difficult? Yeah, you know you what? Job for me? I'm sending. Whoa. I won't let you down. I'm gonna send these guys back to base. You can do it, buddy. Survive! Survive! Okay, he's got his buddies. I think we're okay. There we go. The coal class is going to do its best. Oh yeah, you guys are done for it. Don't even try. You can try. Please don't. Come on, get out, get out. He made it. Okay, he made it. I'm happy. For the home world. We can get him repaired back at base. In fact, uh, I totally forgot. We need to be dealing with... What is this? Battlefield promotions? Be able to gain valuable battle experience when you play. Huh. Interesting. Uh, we'll be doing that eventually. What I want is this. And then we're gonna do pretty much that. Actually, let's just go down the line on Civi if we can. More crystal. Maybe not, but hey. We're gonna go with Eco. You're not going to do very well, sir. Oh no! All right. Link active. So we've taken over Gromov. Ready well, we battle. haven't plopped on it yet. Yes, but Commander. We shall do At that. Once. There it is. Transmission received. So this is our little colonizer. Ready I sometimes call orders. it the pill bug. Research and complete. he's going to go colonize our new planet that we've just imperialized. Good for him. Good. Good Research boy. complete. So I don't know about you, Sparky, but uh, I'm not doing so well in Crystal. Uh, yeah. It's kind of rough right now. Yeah. Fortunately, I have an ice planet that I will be taking. Oh, check that out. And Taros is a comet. Sweet. Can't do anything with the comets, but they look nice. <laughs> Marin is a rock. Okay, we can take Marin. We will probably do that next. So, it's pretty important to check your credit summary, which is in the bottom right Research corner right complete. now. Same with these, actually, as well. Because um, you end up with, like, fleet upkeep, and even more surprising is once you colonize a planet, you actually start taking a loss from that planet immediately. So you have to basically just simply research its <clears throat> infrastructure, and once this infrastructure is researched to a certain level, it'll start making a profit, and you're good. But first time we ever played this game... I remember we didn't know what we were doing, and we never upgraded the infrastructure, and we ran out of money so fast it was quite sad. <laughs> okay, cool. So the fleet's back together. 
Or we'll be back together. It's gonna, come on, get these guys. What now? Oh man, that guy got so beat up. Uh, no, let's. There we I go. won't let you down. Okay. Wow, yeah, that's Research exactly completed. what I wanted you to do. Yes, Try this again. There we go. At once. Okay, so we want to build now a repair facility. Ah, oh, crap. I have auto thing down. Oh, well, I don't care. Technically, you should be really careful as to where you put buildings, so if you do get attacked or whatnot, then, you know, it can be dealt with easily. But since I tend to play macro from over here, I have it on auto build, so I kind of just jacked that up, but I can work around it. Ah, Garuda. Okay, we now know where the Vanitas faction are. They're in Garuda. That's their homeworld. So that's our primary target. Once we take that planet over, they are out of the game. And it looks like the other human faction is... I can't pronounce that. Weirstross? Research complete. Something like that. I'm going to call it Weirstross. And what do we have here? This is one of Sparky's Seekers. Have fun. So let's have a look over at Sparky real quick. Since we're pretty much not doing anything useful right now. Um, well actually, we do need to be doing useful stuff, though. We're in City, right? Yep. Okay. Not doing much right now. It's kind of yeah, early game can be a little research slow. Research the volcanic, so we like live on volcanoes. Oh my gosh, that's absolutely planet. right. I didn't even Allied think about that. Are being attacked. I'm not even sure I can take that planet over. Oh, I totally didn't think of that, dude. I am like so out of crystal right now. Structure complete. All right. Research and complete. I kind of need crystal like really badly, so I'm gonna pull some back so that I can get a civvy research here. And what that'll allow me to do is get where are you? Arctic exploitation. And that eventually will let us take this planet. So I'm kind of stuck right now. Actually, that's not true. There is another spot that I can send Tom these Lake guys. Active. That would be right here. So the we're gonna pull our fleet our back out. Uh oh. Increased. Looks like we're prepping for a pirate invasion. Outstanding. Somebody wants me dead. Did you put... You put money on the Vanitas, didn't you? That I did. A uh, Luxian Resurgence. Okay. Fun. It was on me. Research complete. Was it? Huh. Research complete. Was. Actually, I shouldn't have done that. I wish I could take it back. I will take the pirates. That is great. I, I'm actually not at all prepared for pirates. Mm, attacking so. an empire has become more profitable. Which empire? Oh, they want you dead. Phase jump yeah, they just, complete. you got 720 on your head right now. <laughs> uh, maybe I'll kill the pirates, actually. Okay. It's probably not a bad idea for one of us to do that, because you gain a lot of XP. And yeah. that's more of my YouTube watchers, because Sparky already knows this. Structure complete. Got my trusty soda. Good to go. Pirate Corvettes are, on the are awesome. So we're going to build some more Corvettes. Yeah, you know what, Sparky, you were totally right. I, like, didn't play Corvettes much at all. And... They're awesome. Oh, wow, they are. They kill everything. They're, like, the counter to everything. The biggest problem is, I think <coughs> they're weak against Flak Frigates. Allied yeah. forces they're, are being attacked. They're kind of glass hammers. Oh, you know what I forgot Plotting to do? Plotting jump coordinates. I think I forgot. Yeah, I did. There we go. That allows it to where they phase jump at once instead of one by one. It comes in really useful because you come in as a giant armada rather than just like one little ship that gets blown up after the other. What's Apollo? So, hmm. What's going on? Looks like we got most everything. Did I lose all of my scouts? I think all my scouts are dead. Fortuna. Isn't that a... Wasn't that a planet in uh, Star Fox? I think that was a planet in Star Fox. The bigger I they mean. are, the harder <laughs> I hit them. Yeah, Star Fox was pretty cool. Oh, my childhood. Okay. Let's see here. Reporting for duty. Obronce. Ithaca. How come I'm the one that always loses my scouts, and then yours are just going crazy? Or do you just rebuild them after they die? Uh, no. I haven't built any yet. Those That's are the crazy. free ones I got in the beginning. Okay, fleet's in place. Ready. Time to break stuff. Yeehaw! Where are these guys? The Naos Reserve. I like how everything's got a name in this game. That's awesome. Yeah, there's not much to worry about on this. 
Asteroids usually don't have a lot of defense. Look at that. Pushing any plants are hard to take over. Oh, oh they have a lot of defense? Yeah. Alright, so we need to be very prepared once we try to take over the fir our first Oceanic, which there is one not too far from us uh, at Makino. And it looks like it's halfway between us and the other Terrans, so we're probably going to end up in a fight. Possibly a three-way fight. Should be interesting. I am not where I want to be. Here's where I want to be. Alright, we've commander. taken this. And since our colonizer Go is ahead. not able to take that... Well, can we? How long is this going to take to research? Whoa. It's actually going to be pretty quick. Maybe we'll this wasn't here before. What wasn't here before? Active. Oh! A cloud of... something. Where's it at? On my, uh... Asteroid belt? Yeah. Elasis. Ah, yes. Welcome to random events. What does that do? I don't know. Oh. Strike craft launch disabled. <laughs> oh. Oh my gosh, I think Skype's being retarded. I think Skype's like auto boosting you, and now I'm getting like feedback. Darn you, Skype. We may have to switch back over to like TeamSpeak or Ventrilo at some point. Good There's day, no way around it. Either. Okay, we're gonna actually wait because we have fast research on, and boom! Research complete. We now have that. That'll be handy. Actually, stick that. More stick crystal that is needed. Do your job. Uh, do your job. Where to, Commander? Oh, he's gonna do his job. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> so does we. Sorry, guys. Okay. I like these little things because, like, you actually get to see them launch. Come oh. on. Launch it. Launch it. Do it. Do it. Ah. Please? Please? There it goes. A new see? colony has been founded. <coughs> little launch boxes. Goodbye, launch boxes. Launch boxes. Research complete. Oh, the only More reason I'm here needed. is for this. We need that so badly. Uh, okay, we're going to take a loss on this, and here's proof of it. See, if you look down on bottom right, Gromov is 3.3 red. That means we're losing 3.3 in cash for that. Fortunately, we don't take losses in minerals, just in monies. Comlink active. Okay, so now that we're good here, oh, I just noticed Ready my battleship, the Kiev. Ready for battle. Is ready for an upgrade. And we'll do this. Okay, and we have fighter squadron management. Wait, why are there pirates at my base? Because Good it took day, them that long commander. to get to you. Wait, well, they were attacking purple, I thought. No, I think they went for you. Oh. Yep, they're Added after you. Development finished. Oops. <laughs> You're like, I, I removed my fleet. Ready like, really, really far away. Let's go explore a comet. That's more like it. As in, let's go explore a comet. There you go. Oh, check that out. There's a desert one right here. I'm gonna take that next. You know, I haven't even been paying, paying attention to time. This could be like the longest video ever. Or ever. Structure complete. Good day, Commander. So what I think I'm going to do is probably give it another five minutes, and then I'm going to cut this one off. And we'll start a new one up. Sounds good. Comlink active. <sighs> Whoa. I didn't realize it was above us. That happens? I thought everything was on a flat plane. That's cool. The universe isn't flat. Just the Body world is. Alright, here we go. Phase jump Phew. complete. Structure complete. Oh, who are these guys? They got nice emblems. 
these are the Aluxian refugees. We're killing refugees. That makes us the worst people in the universe. Yeah, well, it's got to be that. What if they're mean refugees? Maybe they are mean. Just the saying. Only, only thing we get from this is experience. Oh yeah, fighters. Water is checking in. A new colony has been founded. Yeah, that was also one of the things, Mike. Was uh, you're all oh, my fighters are awesome. I was like, nah, dog, nah. Whoa, 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 whoa. What, what is this thing? Oh, eh. It's moving from it's, planet it's to a, planet. It's a random event. Oh wow, it's gonna all my ships are done. <laughs> it may not kill your ships. Yeah, Dude, Sparky just got hit by another random event. I, it should tell you if you click on it. Oh, that, that's what it's just doing. It's making my strike strike craft can't move out. Yeah, that's not as bad. Although, since our sun seems to be doing that, I should probably be less reliant on strike craft, which kind of sucks. Cause I really wanted to launch a carrier. I'm still going to launch Percherons, but that's going to so hurt me. Okay, we are doing okay. Oh, right. Right here. Structure complete. There we go. Okay, guys, let's get back into the action here. Oh, but anyways, what I was saying was, uh, apparently fighters are actually way better at destroying frigates than bombers are. Our allies' planet is under siege. My allies' planet is under siege. Do you need help there? There is no further profit in attacking an I'm ally. I'm an idiot, too, because I just realized something. Good day, Commander. They have one of these, and we're not killing it. The Guard of Flak Frigates will eat my fighters for breakfast. Not good. Oh <laughs> man, we are losing so many ships. I should probably pay more attention to that. Let's uh, let's build these guys back. Not that one. I don't want that. Structure complete. We'll do that. Whoa! Oh! Oh no! Red one. Red one took damage. Red one is down. They killed Torkin. Oh, I'm gonna for battle. Is there anything left? Okay, they just this guy. It's <laughs> the last of our fighters. I don't know if they cost to rebuild or not. Oh, I guess not, because there's more. There we go. The bigger they are, the harder I hit them. Oh, and we're taking Good out a scout while we're at it. Never mind, we took out a scout. Ready for battle. Okay, awesome. That really didn't benefit us much at all, so that was just for fun. Let's go back here. I do not like the fact that I have to go through like so many jumps just to get back to base. In fact, you know what? Reporting for duty. That's more like it. Let's keep him here. Got a instead, job for me? I'll we'll send these guys best. here. And that should give me yes, everybody. Okay, that'll be nice. Hey, let's do something useful. Um uh, see I got a couple more minutes before I'm gonna end this. So I guess I'll just show off, uh, jump show off, whatever. Uh, military. Yeah, I need to build military. So I guess we'll just do this Allied for now. Are being attacked. And for city, we're doing okay. I'm going to pop these up there. This, I think, makes buildings cheaper. And this is just a sensor drone thing, so I'll probably get it, but it's not hugely important. Oh, and looks like I am the top. So next time... <laughs> Next time the pirates come by, they're probably going to come for me. I may let them. It'll make it more Ready interesting anyway. Battle. Normally I like to be the target of such aggressions. So yes, Indeed, Sparky. Commander. Huh? Feel free to uh, let the battle. pirates attack me next round. Structure I am okay complete. with this. I'm just going to try to amass a fleet as best as I can, which isn't going to work out too well, but Our we'll see what happens. Joining the fight. Ah, there we go. Research complete. Alright guys, well, I think I'm going to end it here because our reinforcements are about to meet up. So once we get back, uh, we will be reinforced, which is nice. And I don't know how I'm going to cut these up. I'm going to try to do... I have no idea how long this went because I totally forgot to time it. My gosh, this is the most naive video ever. But I'm going to try to make these around 30 minute videos as best as I can. So... <laughs> Hope you guys like what you're seeing, and if you do, go ahead, hit that like button, comment, and tell us uh, what we could do better. Uh, I will say that I'm going to be doing this entire series in a giant batch, but 
I would like to continue doing Sins of a Solar Empires and similar 4Xs and other things, strategy games and stuff like that in the future as well. So let us know if you have any pointers, and uh, we'll Research definitely see you in the next complete. one. Have fun.